Yeah, throw fruit at Pokemon. We purposely starve all the Pokemon in our park so that when you throw food at them, they'll definitely go for it so you can take a picture of them. <laughs> <laughs> look, look at him. That Pikachu's starving. Here, uh, intake all the food. <laughs> like, he looks really cute and shit, but like... If you translate what he's saying, he's just like, FINALLY! <laughs> MY GOD! I'M SO HUNGRY! <laughs> You're just like, smile for the camera, Pikachu! I'm so Pika-hungry! <laughs> I'm so hungry! <laughs> <laughs> we just stuff this Pikachu full of fruit, and just <laughs> and gets really obese. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like the original Pikachu. Yeah. I remember how round he was? Yeah, that was God. He was so much cuter. Yeah, I like I like the original Pikachu design. They made the they made new Pikachu just be more like, kind of like uh. He's lean. Yeah, like he's been doing some some battles. Yeah. Some battles. Yeah, first Pikachu was a little pudgy and lazy and just ate fruit. Yeah. And laughed at Ash. <laughs> he shocked Ash. Yeah. When he when he'd try to take his food. What do you mean there's all kinds of ways to use it? You eat it. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's food. There's different ranges in which you can throw it. Oh, okay. For them to eat it. Yeah, you can either lightly toss it at them so that they can enjoy it, or you can full on just New York Yankees fucking home run that shit at their forehead <laughs> and kill them. <laughs> <laughs> you can slam dunk it into their face, <laughs> into their mouth, <laughs> into their mouth. <laughs> Like NBA you open style, her mouth and you just you fucking Michael Jordan that shit. <laughs> like stretch your arm out and your tongue's out their, and your legs are spread and you're just like <laughs> you just throw it down their neck. <laughs> <laughs> and it just like circular like goes down their down their throat like fucking ski ball. <laughs> <laughs> I bet that's how you feed a licky tongue. He just like unrolls his tongue like a like a fruit roll up, and you just like you bowl it into their mouth. <laughs> yeah, he, he flops it onto the ground, yeah. and you just you just bowl it up the tongue into the throat. Yeah, it smacks his uvula, and, it, and like the Wii Sports thing pops up, and it says "Strike." <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's a Illumina uh, p spot. What do we got to do now? I wasn't reading. I think these are. Uh there's requests. Oh, okay, yeah. So now we can actually pick up the fruit and shit and use it to get better photos. Anyway, with how, with how good this game looks, man, it's got me really excited for Pokemon Legends Arceus. Because, like, if that game looks half as good as this does, with also being to interact with environments, it's going to be amazing, man. Oh, no, this is sick. It's this is so good. Oh, shit, I missed him with a stick in his mouth. <laughs> Come back here with a stick in your mouth. I jumped into the river. <laughs> oh, you did? No, oh, he did. Oh, there goes little... Amolga! Holy hell. <laughs> Hello, is this Amolgus? <laughs> Amolgus. <laughs> okay, yeah, there's the... The thangs. There he is! <gasps> oh, I got him! I got him! <laughs> God, dude. <laughs> we are grown men. <laughs> 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 you know what Speak I mean? Speak for yourself, you know what I mean? Yeah, I guess so. I'm trying I'm trying to relive my youth. Same. All that Bidoof is like in his happy place. Yeah. He's just living his best damn life. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Get it? Oh! No. What? I said he's living his best damn life. Oh! <laughs> I did get that. <laughs> <laughs> I love how there's little Pokemon that like follow you around on the trail. That just shows how playful they are. Yeah, dude. Like I love that. Imagine wildlife is like this instead of like, because in real life all it is is just like lions, like freaking destroying a group of <laughs> buffalo or something. <laughs> you know what I mean? Well, even like past that, most of it's like zoos, and I, I really have a distaste for zoos. I think you should prefer, or you should preserve, uh, like, uh, environments and, like, safaris instead of just taking an animal and putting it in a cage for a bunch of loud Americans 
the point and throw greasy popcorn at and be like, look at the big funny monkey! You know? Yeah, I... I like, you're just, you're depriving them of their instincts. And I, I, I get, like, the whole, like, preservation of, of, like, endangered species. Like, I'm all for that. But just, like... Why don't you take more responsibility as a human being and, like, don't hunt endangered animals, right? Like the WWF? No, I, I totally get that. Because if they... If, if animals are in the World Wrestling Federation... Yeah. Then It'd that's... Be a lot, that's like, it's pretty much, like, illegal, like, chicken or dog fights. Yeah, it's like cockfighting. Yeah. <laughs> Except it's like a big wrestling ring with, like... Like roided up gorillas, yeah, just they, going they just at it, stick them with roids, and it's yeah. like it's friggin' muscly animal. Yeah, it's, animals fighting it's like each other. Two like it's legit pseudo King Kong fighting whatever pseudo Wudo. Yeah, fighting <laughs> Genghis Kong. <laughs> Genghis Khan. <laughs> Genghis Khan. <laughs> Dude, I missed the. Uh, I think I missed the floor. Just you didn't. I, did. I mean, I, I got a picture, but some something about freaking aura or some shit with that mission. Oh. <laughs> the floor just didn't have a good aura about it. <laughs> yeah. Like, today's is just an off day. Just delete the picture to make it feel better about itself. Have you ever pulled a prank before? Oh, you mean... Like, on, on somebody? Yeah. <clears throat> like, what kind? Uh, I did the one where you get on your hands and knees and uh, some your duo, like, pushes them over you. Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? You get yeah. behind their legs on your hand. Yeah, and somebody pushes them and they fall over yeah. you. Man, what a dick move. <laughs> that is a dick. It, it really is. <laughs> uh, on my ex-wife, one time when she was sleeping, I poured uh, um, iodized salt on her eyelids. When, so when she woke up, like, her eyes bled. It was really funny. Oh, shit. Like, dude. she woke up and she was like, ah! And I jumped up on the bed and I was like, you just got pranked! <laughs> I walked up to a friend one time, and I punched him in the face. Oh, you just got pranked! <laughs> she she also used to have like a really bad smoking problem, so like I poured a uh, lighter fluid on her on her cigarettes, and she lit one up, and it blew her face <laughs> off, like Gus from Breaking Bad. And I was like, oh, you just got pranked. <laughs> the joke's on me though. She divorced me. I cheated on my ex-wife, and when she caught me, I was like, oh, you just got pranked. And then we divorced, and then we left. I pranked her current husband. I dressed up as her and fucked him. And then I pulled off the wig and I was like, You got pranked! <laughs> yeah, that got kind of dark. Anyway. <laughs> That's kind of dark, like, in a weird way. No, it's funny. It's funny. <laughs> they, got, they got pranked, it's man. It's dark humor. No, it's pranked. It's, it's funny. Like some weird dark humor. Okay. <laughs> I mean, it is. I once had a friend back in college that, uh, I, I, uh, he had a tub of butter in the fridge, and, uh, I scooped out the butter, took out the bottom layer, shit into the tub of butter, and then put the layer of butter on top of the shit and put it back in the fridge. Oh my god. <laughs> That's actually a real thing. <laughs> That's called turd buttering. Turd buttering? Yeah. It's probably the worst thing that you can do to somebody. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like it. <laughs> Yeah, that's 100%. One of the worst things that you could totally do to a person in their entire life. That's a, that's a new clickbait title for this video. The worst thing that you could ever do. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, those prank videos on YouTube got kind of old because they're all fake, you know? Yeah, I mean, because I feel like initially at the start of the whole prank videos, like they were, they started out real and then they were like, Oh, we, we need to do this all the time for the views, and they yeah, started yeah. faking them. Remember the John Cena prank call, the classic. Where they like, oh they yeah, kept calling like this lady John over. Cena. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dun, dun. and like it all leads up, like she's so fucking mad, like it leads up to the end, and it's like, would you like to donate to the U.S. military? And she's like, yes, I'm so sorry. Like I've just been getting these prank calls, and it's, and it's just like. A, a member of the U.S. military, John Cena. Bam, 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 bam. She's like, you gotta be fucking kidding me. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good. That, that's classic. That's old, too. That's been around for a while. I gotta quit this one. I don't I don't know what I'm doing. Did you ever watch uh, Prank Invasion? Like, he didn't even do pranks. He'd just go out in public and just, like, 
go on Craigslist and and pay actresses to be in his videos and just be like making out, uh, you know, playing a, a game with a chick, and if she loses, she has to kiss me, like that type of shit. Oh yeah, uh, it was really weird. He had some weird videos, like he had one where it was just like. I'm, I'm here in the Santa Monica Pier in California, and I totally didn't go hire some women on the internet to be in my video, and we're gonna, I'm gonna be making out with, uh, with, with pregnant moms. And you're like, what? <laughs> it's like, he just hired, like, pregnant women to be in his video so he could kiss them. <laughs> and then he made a website and was just like, if you, if you come and pay me on my website, I'll, I'll give you a, a, a set list of the top five ways to pick up girls. Number one, pay for them on the internet. <laughs> it's just like, pff. yeah, that's it's weird, know. man. It is weird. I, I don't. I mean, I don't personally see the in, the what what's interesting about that specifically. But I don't know. Some prank videos are pretty funny. Like, uh, yeah. like the whole. Uh, I really wanted to get somebody with the. Um, uh, saran wrap uh, on, oh, the on the door. toilet seat. Well, on the toilet seat too. Yeah. But I'm, I'm talking about on the door. And when they walk, when you're oh. like, "Hey, dude, come here, hurry!" And they just walk in and just get faced with, <laughs> just get faced with saran wrap. I'd want to do that, but like Home Alone style, <laughs> where uh, uh, where uh, Harry was uh, no uh, yeah, Harry was the uh, Joe Pesci character, right? Uh... I, the bald one? Yeah, I think. Okay. Um, I think it was in the second movie. <laughs> he fucking, like, f like tars and feathers him. <laughs> oh, yeah. He gets, like, tar on his head and gets, like, and, like, it blows feathers on him and just sets his head on fire. <laughs> <laughs> I'd want to do that. <laughs> like, did somebody walk through, like, like, you just have, like, a roommate or whatever, and they just, like, walk through the door, and they're just like, Hey, man, you remember the Wi-Fi password? Fucking just get tarred, and then, like, shot feathers and just sat on fire. <laughs> That's horrible. It is. It's funny. It is. <laughs> uh, Home Alone is such a fantasy for that shit, too. Like, now that I think about it. Like, Kevin McAllister... Realistically, he would have murdered Harry and Marv. <laughs> Like, when they were in the house, they were going up the stairs and, like, slipped on, like, the, the toy cars. And, like, he was legit throwing full cans of paint at their heads. Remember that? Like, he tied it to, like, the ceiling as they were coming up the stairs. And you see, he threw them down and smacked them in the forehead. And then they fell off the stairs. Oh, man. God. God. Realistically, he, he, he would have murdered them. <laughs> <laughs> Forever my favorite one is in the second movie when uh when Marv gets electrocuted. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> like he turns into a skeleton. <laughs> <laughs> Just the scream he does. Like it clips the audio. <laughs> it's so loud. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> you hit him in the eyeball. I hit him right in the face. <laughs> he turns around and was like, I was letting you take pictures of me, but you can fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah! <laughs> There's one I have to get of him staring off in the distance. Contemplating life. <laughs> Contemplating his existence. I love the big flower around its neck. It's like the it's like the thing that they put around a dog's neck when they're trying not to get him to lick his balls. <laughs> you know? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good. It was clipping through his head. <laughs> <laughs> that's what ruined it, dude. That, that honestly ruined it. <laughs> Professor's like, this is a brilliant picture. I love the way the leaves are clipping through his neck. <laughs> Sweet, I guess. <laughs> That's all right, I guess. I mean, that was good. It was just I was just trying to do a mission. I couldn't find out what I was supposed to do. I was just too focused on my objective. I couldn't even just enjoy being where I was at. <laughs> <laughs> my only thing with this is, like, I have to do all these missions, I guess, to move forward. Yeah. I assume. Uh-huh. I want to get to new places and take pictures of new Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> I want to go to new places, new heights. I want to broaden my horizons. And quite frankly, Professor, you're holding me back. <laughs> little Eevee. I like Eevee. A new little Eve. I'd like to have a little pet Eevee. Same. Holy crap, that'd be cool. Yeah. You just, you, uh, you're on a, you're on a walk one day, you find a, Thunderstone. Jolteon, mm -hmm. dude. Jolteon. Yeah. 
What's your favorite EV? Or I already know. Zumbreon. It is Zumbreon. It used to be Leafeon. And Mine's then. ESP Eon. <laughs> ESP P Eon. The sports Pokemon. <laughs> you give EV a like a fucking fucking soccer ball and it just evolves into ESP Eon. All his attacks are just throwing ball different sports balls at people. Yeah. Or at other Pokemon. Yeah. At people. <laughs> No, what you're thinking of is a salty on. <laughs> salty on. <laughs> it just assaults people. <laughs> a salty on. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Aw. Look at them. They're friends. That's a good one. Oh, that was a good one, dude. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> I love how genuinely happy this game makes us. <laughs> just seeing them interact with it. It's like, oh, they're friends. <laughs> I They're gotta... totally not real. <laughs> Come on, shock it. Okay, cool. Hopefully those work. Because it was like from the back. <laughs> Hopefully. They worked, I think. <laughs> <laughs> you just got ghosted, man. I did. Oof. I am starved then. Man, he left you on red like four times. <laughs> <laughs> he did. He did. He <laughs> did. Do you think there's a website called Only Friends? Only Friends? Yeah. You gonna take pictures of your friends? <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking more or less it'd be like a website where like... Where like somebody's kink is getting friend zoned. <laughs> So you just pay you just pay people to like converse with you and like act interested in you and then after like a week or two they're just like you're such a good friend. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know anybody out there who has a kink of like getting friend zoned is man they they like some hard shit. <laughs> I think that'd be really funny. Yeah. Just like a like a monthly subscription of just having chicks tell you that you're like a brother to me. <laughs> 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 oh, man. Oh, that's, that's pretty good. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we got a four star, dude. Nice. If this was GTA, that'd be pretty good. That'd be a lot of policemen. <laughs> <laughs> the police just show up. It's just this <laughs> nice little meadow and just like all the Pokemon are just grazing. Fucking helicopters and cop cars. <laughs> we start running them over with the pokey pod. <laughs> like the SWAT team shows up and just like, just like all hell breaks loose. That'd be rough. That would be rough. Be weird. <laughs> I mean, that's the last thing I would expect in that. I would expect like park rangers at the least. Yeah. Or like Pokemon rangers. Do they do any more with Pokemon Rangers? Uh, I know they had like the DS game of them. They and wasn't there a movie as well? Yeah, I think. Uh, yeah, they're they still had, in uh, game. Yeah. They had Latios and Latios, right? Yeah, the Pokemon Rangers. Yeah. How are they different than trainers? They don't catch the Pokemon, do they? They're uh, they're more of like kind of like a. Like an actual for like a forest yeah. ranger. They like, just like befriend the Pokemon, don't they? They don't actually. They catch protect them. the wilderness. Oh, okay. Yeah. They're they're cool. <clears throat> okay, so this is fun. We're now there's the Florgus one I was talking about. Oh, how do what? How do we know? Uh, it looks see, normal that's to what me. I was, that's what I was talking about. Was uh, <laughs> living it up. Oh, livening up the flowers. I was living it up in the <laughs> living flowers. It up in the flowers. <laughs> Pokemon. Pokemon monsters. Pokemon, Pokemon. monsters. Johto. <laughs> park by day, not by night. <laughs> <laughs> no parking at night. <laughs> no parking at the park, barb. At the park, bud. Barb. Bed. Barb. Bed. Barb. Bud. Barb. Okay. Barb. I say bud because he's a flower, and what do flowers do? They bud. Barb. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Do your best. <laughs> what? He said, oh, <laughs> he's, well, he's talking to me. He's like, oh, so do, he's your saying, do your best. Do your best. That's a Drake and Josh bit that always gets me. Like he gets a Josh gets like a package delivered, and he goes, the guy goes, 
have a nice day. Or no, Josh goes, has a nice, have a nice day. And he says, don't tell me what to do. <laughs> <laughs> hey, dude, have a wonderful evening. Don't tell me that. Don't tell me what to do. You don't, run, you. You don't run my life. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I love how everybody's just, just so rude to Josh for no reason. Like, jo like, at the movie theater, like, Josh does nothing but, like, a great job all the time. And Drake is just a, a delinquent. And Helen's always just like, I love me some Drake! I had a late reaction. Or that would have been a really pretty pick. A delayed reaction! The dit, the dit, the dit, the dit, the dit, the Yep. <laughs> yep. If we get to hatch an egg... Like us. I mean... I hope it's Togepi. Like, not even a Pokemon egg. Like, I hope our character just hatches an egg. <laughs> just there in the pod. The pod is like an incubator. <laughs> we just hatch an egg and... Yeah. yeah. Oh, he ate it that time. He didn't cuck me that time. <laughs> Look at... Hey, he wasn't a little cuck at you this time. Are you coming to thank me? He goes, fuck you, pissy bitch. He runs off. <laughs> <laughs> He goes, well, at least you ate the fruit, idiot. <laughs> Just shut up and eat the fruit, you idiot. <laughs> shut up, idiot. <laughs> We're pretty much just the beavis and butthead of commentators. <laughs> Aren't we? <laughs> Aren't we? I mean, that's pretty much what we do, is that we just make we just make fun of stuff, and we just, we just laugh at each other. <laughs> like, we'll just make a joke and go, <laughs> 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 That's pretty- that's what we are, dude. We're the beavis and butthead of Let's Players. That's pretty much what we, we are. Yeah, we are. That's weird. We go, look at that, that's stupid. <laughs> <laughs> and then you're- and then you're the one that's just like, <laughs> And you're like, you're like, Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> Almost Barney's laugh. <laughs> Oh, can we catch a wild Barney? <laughs> yeah, dude. What's this? What's your shit? What's your shit? What's this picture? Ooh, baby! Oh, that's good, dude. Ooh. God, yeah. Eat that apple, you beautiful bitch. God. <laughs> <laughs> Gorgeous Florges. You just throw a Pokeball at Barney, and he pops back out, and he goes, <laughs> <laughs> Barney! Are you... Are you overfeeding these Pokemon again? <laughs> <laughs> wow. No, dude, click on that picture. <laughs> no, that the one that you clicked on. You know you know what his vines look like? What? They're the exact shape of Sonic the Hedgehog's eyes. Oh my god. <laughs> Aren't they? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, do a side by side. That's Sonic the Hedgehog's <laughs> eyes. <laughs> Gotta go fast. <laughs> Gotta eat fast. That's, that's straight up his eyes, dude. <laughs> that's insane. It is. It is. <laughs>